Hey guys, so um, I wanted to give a little bit of an update. I'm in the plant room again. It's a nice place to record videos, don't you think? All right, so um, it is day eight, and so it's been a week. Um, so far, it's been going well. I've had some interesting, um, I guess you could say, uh, side effects in the first week. Um, namely, I feel like I can't eat nearly as much as I wanted to. Um, I'm still kind of getting m my calories in for the most part, but um, I noticed that uh, in the beginning it was a little bit harder. Um, my digestion was a little slow, or I feel like maybe my body was expecting more carbs. So um, I've been taking those electrolytes, which has helped. And the other thing I noticed is that uh, I've been testing my ketones on a daily basis, and um, I noticed that when I eat right after um, testing my ketones, if my ketones start off too low, then eating depletes the rest of my ketones rapidly and then I end up in a fatigued state for like three hours. So I've noticed now that I'm, my ketones are a little higher, um, like over one, like 1 1.4. Uh, whenever I eat now, I don't have that dip in energy. So I think this is exclusively a problem if you're hypothyroid. Uh, so I I'm going to do a full video on that. Uh, I have some ideas there. But for people who are like hypo and either don't have sufficient thyroid hormone or under medicated or whatever, if you have symptoms and your metabolism is generally slow, then I think taking it, taking it slow and eating smaller portions would be really helpful if you're doing this diet. Um, I'm now in a place where I feel like mentally sharper. Um, very often I'll wake up actually and feel like this Zen peaceful state of mind or, or whatever. Um, and I, this morning I, you know, I had enough resolve to kind of create a new morning rot routine for myself. Uh, I downloaded some apps. I organized myself a little better. So I think all of these are good signs. Physically, I feel good. Um, I didn't get a whole lot of sleep last night because I think I didn't eat enough the day before. And I noticed with myself, anytime I do any sort of fasting, including intermittent fasting, um, I'll notice that my muscles will feel, sore is not the right word, but I'll feel almost like a, like a vasoconstriction, meaning like I'll feel like a, uh, my there's like nerve impingement or something, or I'll feel like a stiffness in, in my muscles. So I think that has to do with um, maybe reduced water content in the muscles, reduced glycogen, um, or something like that. Again, it could be related to the adaptation. So I'm not going to change anything again. I'm going to stay faithful to the experiment. But I just wanted to give you guys a heads up and an update. Um, yeah, feeling pretty good. I'll see you guys in the next video.